Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World The Game where today uh, I've got a lot to talk about. We have a lot to talk about. Because um, apparently if you look at the front you'll notice some things have changed with my park. Um, you'll notice that the uh, statues are um, some are missing and in no way is this clickbait but my account was stolen. <laughs> <laughs> After three years <clears throat> of playing this game, my account was actually taken uh, from me. It started when I went to the event in for Jurassic World Evolution, and I came to the hotel and I logged in. And when I logged in, it came up with a weird message. It was like, do you want to merge your Facebook with visitor account? and uh, Or do you not want to do that and lose all your progress? And I was like, well, uh, no, hold on, I don't want to do that. And when I logged in, it restarted. It, it had that intro um, animation that happens when, you know, it's at night and it's taken the Majungasaurus to the battle arena. That happened. And when that happened, oh, now it's to the left, is it? Will they stop moving these blooming packs? God damn it. This is like, oh, we'll try and make your waste books. So you realize I only have 5,000 books. And I only have 55,000 VIP points. I used to have like 15,000 bucks and like 70 odd thousand VIP points. So a lot of things have, uh, have disappeared. And you'll notice the trophies, like some of these ones, have vanished as well. However, um, luckily I managed to get the account back. And there you go. Here, there's that one and there's another. I think another... Um, Another trophy, sorry, another statue has disappeared. There was one more because we did the salamander, we've done the dodo, we've done uh, omega, and we did, we've done one recently and we got that one. I can't remember what that was now that I think about it. So these ones were actually over here. So luckily the the person who took the account, now this this is the interesting thing. I actually have an email from Ludia because I got in touch with them and was like, have I just lost all my progress? <laughs> and they managed to, somehow they managed to find it, like track it, the account down. And they said, the person who took control of my account managed to sell the following. One Indominus Rex, one uh, Super Kool-Aid, eight Bonogamuses, which I don't know if that's true, because I, I checked, um, I checked this. And Bonogamus, I only have one level 40, but ap apparently they've sold eight of those, and they sold eight Adustuses. Um, they also um, sold one of the boss statues. Uh, based on your most recent video, we confirmed it was missing. So they, they, they came into the account, they sold a bunch of stuff. Uh, not only that, but they, they entered the lottery, like they entered one 200 buck lottery thing. And they also entered like 10 of the VIP lottery things. It's so weird. Like, whoever, whoever managed to take control of my account. Um, oh, oh, as an as a, addition to that, there was also another, uh, another dinosaur and six buildings sold. Um, so, whoever took control of the account didn't do it with malicious intent. Um, they just sort of, well, I don't know, it's weird. It's like they were like, oh, I've got control of his account. And then they sold a couple of things and were like, wait, what if, like, I get, um, like, in trouble for this? Now, what must have happened was they got in touch with Ludia. It's not the first time this has happened. They got in touch with Ludia pretending to be me and must have asked for the account to um, be transferred to a different device. Now, this, like, usually the, this ha this can happen quite to anybody and it's usually safeguarded and never happens because the people who do that, whatever. But somehow this time it did manage to happen. Now, I just want to say impersonating somebody is illegal. That is fraud and you could be jailed for it. <laughs> Even if it is in the sense of like a gaming thing, so um, like now this person, whoever did it, it could even just be a kid. I would say just be careful with that because you could be jailed for it. Um, I'm, I'm not. I'm not trying to scare you. That is illegal <laughs> if you try and impersonate me because I have had it in the past where somebody um, used an email address that was sent back to me uh, asking if my account could be boosted from 75 to 80, and they even signed it as the gaming beep. <laughs> And again, like I said, that's illegal, so... Guys, don't do that. I don't want you guys sent to jail just try to try to get me to level 80. <laughs> it's, it's not gonna happen. Um, so, uh, I'm trying to think of other things. Yeah, they, they put in the other Pritrodon into the, <laughs> the hatchery. And Delivery didn't do that, but there it is now! So they, they helped me with that. Uh, I am also going to um, just hatch these. 
There was something else they did, and I oh yeah, that's right. I like I haven't really been on this account t like until recording this video because I wanted to save everything for it. Um, so everything that was lost, uh, Ludia did manage to uh, reimburse me. So all of the food um, that was gone, they must have uh, fed other things. Uh, coin. Um, yeah, don't really need the coin. The DNA because they sold a lot of things, but there's. Uh, 250,000 and the dino books as well those were that's the important thing because you can't just get those back and these are all of the creatures um that were also uh taken from me so if i'm just gonna quickly uh, oh like a boss oh that's right the maelstorm oh yeah that's what was missing we we did the the mega deer thing oh like th that's awesome thank you ludia for doing this um but one thing I was worried about was the VIP points. I'm like, oh, how am I going to get those VIP points back? Uh, so the Indominus Rex, which we'll collect, um, and then all the uh, the Adustuses and stuff, um, and Bernagamusters. How many Adustuses do I have? I already had, like, one or two, because we must have done the uh, the tournament, because it is a tournament creature. So I just want to say a big thank you to Ludia for um, uh, fixing this issue super quick and reimbursing me for everything that was lost. Um, also... Um, it was their fault that it happened, so, <laughs> like, and they have admitted it, so, in, in a way, like, it's really good that they've, they accept the blame, uh, say this never really happened, and also reimburse me. So, I, could, I couldn't fall on that, and for loyalty points, there you go, 32,000, which takes me to, like, about 70, 80,000 uh, VIP points, which is what I was on before all of this went down. So, that also means we can go back into buildings... And um, find that, that yeah, there we go. And we must have had a John Hammond statue. Now, I can't remember whether this person uh, went into my account. There we go. That's what it looked like originally. Went into my account. And these were all... Like, what they did was basically click all of these, I think. Um, so that really does suck. <laughs> this person. And not only that, they completed the mission. They completed the mission that I was like saving that Claire Deering mission for ages for the XP they complete. Whoever this person was, whoever the kid was, they knew I was saving this mission, I was saving these statues, and they're like, ah! <laughs> just like clicked them all off. <laughs> Little bugger. Oh god. But they like they they were just doing it for like whatever reason, um, obviously just to be a little a little bugger. because uh, they didn't sell everything. Um because otherwise, I mean, it would just be a nuisance. Because uh, it could all have been gone back. So that was lucky. I don't know whether they caught that. So hopefully they've got some parameters in way. Um, I'm sure now there's going to be people like, Oh, you could do that? Oh, I'm going to try to get his account. <laughs> but trust me, like, they're, they're going to say, like, it's not going to... It shouldn't happen. Bloody hell, I hope not. <laughs> not. I was like, yeah, I just did the Packy Rhinosaurus uh, tournament. Let's see if uh, let's see if I won the pack. And I just couldn't get into the account. And also, they they started to participate in this one, like what lies beneath the Chronosaurus. Um, so yeah, guys, don't do it. If they do catch you, they'll be able to trace your email. And if ever somebody wanted to, they could sue you for impersonation, and you could be in you know, big trouble, so don't do it in whatever, like, you might be thinking, because people might do it all the time, like, oh, I'm just going to impersonate this guy online, but it's fraud, it's illegal, don't do it, <laughs> for your own sake, definitely don't do it, um, so yeah, we're, we're back to normal, we had our account stolen, we got it back, no click baity, because there's so many people out there like, I was hacked, or I was kicked, uh, no, this actually did happen, <laughs> I didn't lose control of my account, um, but three years, it's only happened once. I gotta say, it's a good track record. So, you know what? Let's see what we won for this person. I think, I don't even know what this was. It was a Spinosaurus. So, the best case scenario, we win a Spinosaurus. And we only won food. So, that's 200 bucks gone. And this was about 1,500 uh, VIP points. So, what was the prizes? It was a Megalosaurus. Um, so, you, you could probably track exactly when this account was stolen from those prizes. So they left a little, they left their grubby fingerprints all over it. And they also managed to, uh, you know, do the gold fidelity and stuff, apparently. So let's see what they won for us. So 1,400 uh, DNA. Oop, 500, an extra 500 DNA. And <gasps> 1,800 DNA. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> um, yeah, and they also put in the pro troll and they're like, ah, I'm going to put that in. <laughs> Uh, so anyway guys, we're back to normal. Uh, what kind of missions do we have? Because I was hoping that once that um, 
Was it an Enosaur tournament? It was the new tournament. That's right, it was the Pachyrhinosaurus. I was hoping that once the Pachyrhinosaurus tournament was over, that we could get this new hybrid, because this thing's gonna be... Like, people are saying it's ugly. I think it looks awesome. <laughs> it looks really cool. Uh, yeah, it's ugly, but it looks badass. Um, I was kind of hoping that as soon as that Pachyrhinosaurus tournament was up, that we would end up getting this hybrid and unlocking it. But it looks like maybe after the March, after March Madness sort of era, we may get this. And I need to save up as many books, food, and DNA as I can to get this, because this is a mixture between, between Pachyrhinosaurus and Megalosaurus. So maybe after this tournament comes and goes, maybe we'll get it then. Um, sorry, I'm really sniffly. Yeah. <laughs> um, and maybe we'll get it then. Uh, it could be after the end of March. Who knows? But let's, uh, yeah, let's see the Battle Infinite, because this is really tough. Um, a really tough thing to do. Uh, so 4,600. 4,600 attack! Look at Tropical Tropicanathus, like Truki Tukan. 5,000 attack and 17,000 health? That's ridiculous. What are you supposed to do? You know what? I'm going to put in Segnasuchus. I'm going to put in Udon and Metrophodon. And that, that is the best. This is the hardest battle you could ever come up against. And it only gets harder the more uh, creatures you have. So I'm going to go for a reserve because i don't think supra super sopranosaurus ah you come here what you doing <laughs> Could, oh hold on okay did not expect that did not expect the two attack from the pterodactylus oops i expected the switch um that was completely my bad okay i'm gonna go for two attack hopefully kill it i should be able to kill it yeah uh does eight thousand i'm gonna go for a reserve here because he's gonna switch and i know that tuki tukan has five thousand attack and he can't kill me in one hit even if he does switch. Uh, hopefully we can just... Ah, should I kill him though? If I have the chance. Um, because... You know what? I'm going to switch into Metrophodon. And I'm, he has one block. Now... I'm going to go for two block, one reserve. Because he can't kill me in one. He's going to have three. And we're safe, no matter what here. Hopefully he switch out. <gasps> he didn't! Oh no! <laughs> I kind of just want to go for like one, two, three. Kills him, factor in two. Did he do it? Oh, he went for three block! Oh, that's not good. He's going to have four, right? Oh, he's going to... Yeah, he's going to have four and he's going to go for two. Oh, this did not go well. Oh no, no. We, we, we're still in with a chance though. We could still do this. Come on. Because he's got two block. It depends what he does though. Because we have to go for four to kill him. Um, he can kill me in two. So... Uh, one, two, he's dead. Now, it depends on what he does here. If he doesn't go for any block... Oh, he does. Okay, that's good. So, Sopranosaurus only has 1,700, right? 1,500. Yes! I think we've done this. I think we've done it. We've killed Sopranosaurus. Oh, so I keep calling it Sopranosaurus now. Oh, how much damage is that going to do? Oh, 10,000! And that is it. We, I thought we did kill it in two. It was about one... It was about 1,000, sorry, 13,000 uh, damage we did with two attacks, so. There it is, so that, that has to be the hot. Look at this, this video is gonna be, am I my account hacked? Hardest battles ever. <laughs> if I really want to, I guess I could. Uh, but we'll see, we'll see what kind of mood I'm in. And uh, yeah, there you go, um, really quick. Um, I'm trying to think, is there anything else? Uh, battle for survival. That's kind of interesting. We are almost maxed out on food. Of course maxed out on coin um, But DNA we're in good stead for that new hybrid that comes out. I'd say half half a billion Sorry half a half a million DNA <laughs> Half a million DNA. I think we should be able to afford four of them and if worse comes to worse um, We could always sell like yeah, I lost look whoa whoa Hold on. I lost... Did they... Did they merge all of my Indominus Rexes into a level 30? They bloody well did! <laughs> oh no! Oh, that sucks! Because I loved having the uh, level 10s. They did it. Oh, because I was like, wait, I had loads... I had like three level 10 Indominus Rexes and like a level 1. So yeah, they, they put them all together to make a level 30. Hmm. Well, um, that is interesting. Uh, <laughs> they went straight for Indominus Rex and a Super Kool-Aid. Sold one of the Super Kool-Aids. 
sold one of those. So honestly, I don't think the person that managed to get a hold of this account um, really did it with the worst intentions. They didn't go, okay, I'm going to sell everything, I'm going to ruin all of it for him, and then he's going to have to recreate it. They were just like, oh, I've got all these things, I want to click all of them! And then they were like, oh, we could get some extra DNA by selling the Super Kool-Aid, making a level 30 Indominus Rex, because it is actually better than the level 10s, um, and sell the remainder Indominus Rex. Then they put in the Pritrodon into here, so that's obviously something that needed to be done. They participated in the lottery, they also went a little bit into the what lies beneath, so I think this person, whoever took control, was generally just trying to play the game. They also completed a mission as well. Um, so yeah guys, I think I'm gonna leave it here. <laughs> a little short episode, because I just want to, like, explain what was going on, because I felt like I couldn't do a video uh, without explaining that, because that that was something weird that's never happened to me before, and I don't even know how it managed to happen. But um, yeah, it was it was Ludia's fault. It shouldn't have happened, and I don't think it's gonna happen again. I hopefully not anyway. And anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, <laughs> still recording these um, while I'm away, um, I may have to record uh, the new hybrid while I'm still like away in America. But who knows? I think I might I might even be back um, in the UK. Uh, while that happens, what, like while that drops, because if it is, because the embargo, if you remember for Jurassic World Evolution, all the footage, I was there, I, um, I did get to play it and record it, and all the footage will be up on the 29th of March, and I'm imagining that maybe around about the same time, um, this new hybrid will drop, it'll be even bigger, so, uh, it'll be even better than anything we've got in the game, I think it'll be even better than you, Don, if I've got to be, if I've got to be honest, because... Pachyrhinosaurus is a balanced dinosaur, and so is Megalosaurus. So to see what this turns into will be quite interesting. It's a shame it's not a herbivore. It is definitely a carnivore with the uh, the animation it's going to have. It'd be really cool if it was a herbivore and it was just in the herbivore exhibit, and it did look like that and have the carnivore animations. But we're, we've got to go with the track record. It's probably going to be a carnivore. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.